game is beginning to fade, but the quarterback knows his team still has a chance. He must produce something in a hurry. That's a bad job by the offense that time. There's no doubt about it. The blitz by the defense, they do not do a good job of finding out where everybody's blitzing from. They let a guy come free, and that free blitzer, or as we call them, free runners, he gets the hit on the QB and takes him down. When you get in a situation like this as a quarterback, it's in the second half, it's third and long, you're losing a close game, it's up to you to make the right decision. Don't force the issue. If it's not there, throw it short or throw it away. And he's tackled down after picking up the first. And now we reach the two-minute warning. First down. Let's see what they come up with here. Just about two minutes to go, and the defense knows it needs to make one last stop to end it. He's brought down right around the 43-yard line. Second down coming up. Time, obviously, a factor the rest of the way. Second down and four. Tackles made, and that'll move the chains. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Matthew Stafford will be under center. Running away from the pressure. And a nice catch by Calvin Johnson. The Lions have saved all of their timeouts for here in the fourth quarter. Bells in the backfield. Single back set. Hand off. Brought down after a gain of six. Second down. Late in the fourth quarter. Two tight ends on the field here. Second down. Four to go. Able to make the tackle about two yards shy of the first. This is an almost must convert scenario. Third down coming up here in the late stages. Yes, it's four down territory, but you don't want to face make or break at this point. Yeah, on the defensive side, now it's time for the coach to do his job. Be aggressive. Call a defense that the offense has not seen so far today. If you do that, I think you'll catch them by surprise. You have to like what this team has done today, passing the football. It's been their identity this season, and that continues here today. Yeah, he's like, listen, this quarterback is a lot like a pitcher. Some days he'll beat you with the fastball. The next day it's the breaking ball, and that's what he can do, too. He beats you with power or finesse. It doesn't matter. The long drive continues. Second and goal from the seven. Throws the pass. Detroit in the end zone. Good job by the offense. They get in there. They tie this game up. Now we'll see if the defense can take advantage of that momentum and keep it on their side. These two teams have been battling it out all day long. And now in the waning minutes, the game is tied. Yeah, it is. And it's, hey, look at all the big plays we've had here so far today. And I think just in the waning moments, you know what? We'll see one more big play that's going to decide this game. And no return this time as he takes a knee. The Seahawks coming to the line. Still have all three of their timeouts here in the fourth quarter. Michael lined up in the backfield. Wilson from the shotgun. He'll throw it over the middle. Almost intercepted. The Seahawks know they have to get to the 34-yard line to give their kicker a shot. Second down after the incompletion. Wide receivers are bunched up. Wilson from the shotgun. And he's thrown to the ground. Well, that's a sign of a good defense. When you can sack the quarterback when you're just rushing the defensive lineman, you don't need any tricks, you don't need any blitzes. Man, that's talent. Now, looking at third down. Russell Wilson has it under center. Handoff, out of the eye formation. And he will not score. We are headed to overtime. The Lions are ready to receive the kick. A foot race to the end zone. Well, a lot of good things 
happened on both sides of the football this time. How about that return by the return team? Good job, good blocking. Look at the speed of that guy running. They get the tackle from behind. They stop the touchdown. Charging ahead. Bell is tackled down. Another big day for the running back. He came into today's game in the top 10 in the NFL rushing yards, and he's just adding to those yards. Nice run. They give it to him on the counter, and he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Bell is in the backfield. He's setting up here. He's been sacked four times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. And he's taken down. Jim, I'll just say this. You know, when you're getting hit, you get sacked like that. Uh, uh, it, it's hard to find the open receiver down the field because you don't trust your pass protection. To Ebron and Urban's there to make the stop. Ebron's a big target, but he plays that tight end position like he's a wide out, Phil. Yeah, you know what you see now, Jim? It used to be everything was focused around the wide receiver. He was the number one guy in the passing offense. But now we see many tight ends who are the number one option, just like we're seeing here today. Three-step drop. Looking across the middle, muscles through the defender. He's brought down at the 23-yard line. Well, the Deacon Duck quarterbacks, they love to see cover three because they know they're going to drop back and just throw the short passes underneath. Good job by the quarterback taking advantage of this defense. Stafford with the give. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. The Lions have it at the 24. Feeds him again. And that's a gain of maybe five. There's nothing like big running plays for an offense. It just makes the offensive lineman feel powerful. Gives great confidence to the play caller. There's a reason why this guy's in the top 10 rushing yards so far this season. Third and six. Right back to him one more time. Nothing there as this goes for a loss of two. The Seahawks defense is just one of the best in the NFL. What a job that time of the run play. They get penetration, they get in the backfield, and they make the tackle for a loss. Never take it for granted. When you're trying to field goal, a lot of things could go wrong. But good execution that time by the offense and a good kick. Three points. Baldwin's going to test the coverage here. He's got a flag down here. Baldwin tackled down. His head got yanked back the other way. An obvious face mask penalty, and that's a big one. It's about safety of the players, too. That's why when you grab, hit the helmet in certain situations, it's going to be a 15-yard penalty. Don't grab the face mask. A takeaway. The tackle was made. We've got an NFC champion heading to the Super Bowl with high spirits, while the other team must have